And you guys, welcome back to another tutorial of Vibro. In this video, we will show you. It's kind of a remake. It's better say. As soon as you're gonna be a little thing with hair again. But this time, it's kind of a little bit catty and tail. Yeah, both of them. Since some people would like to have two things done at the same time, why not just make a video that covers both of them? Sure, there's a few people that actually just want one specific thing. But yeah. this should help and then well it while it's impossible. Anyways, if you actually have seen the video making channel before or you know, if you actually have subscribed to to this channel, you already know where this is going, get it. If you haven't, what are you waiting for? Really? It's not that hard. And you're not, you don't have to pay anything. It's not like Netflix or Disney Plus that you have to be paying a certain amount per month. Yeah. Would be nice? Depends to who. But. But, you know, since all of this is going on, you know, some economic crisis, you know what to do. Just a little bit tricky. And it's a little bit of a drag, if you ask me. Anyways. Let's continue. So, for those who haven't actually had done this tutorial before, what we're doing right now is just making um, preparations for the other, you know, with the mesh. Because once I started making the candy mesh, it's gonna be a little bit trickier. Not too tricky, but, you know, it's a little bit. You'll see why. Now, once you start making your jaw, you just have to make sure that she stays there and makes some sense. And also point this. Sometimes you have to wiggle around to know exactly what's going on. Does this happen often? Yeah. It kind of does. So if something like this happens, let's go to texture. Yeah. Then you just set the sign. The texture. Then just head over here, which is the full image, and basically just paint it over. And it'll make a difference. And then just paint all of this. And it's in one So now, when we turn, I don't know what's going on here. But we just do it like this. Mm. Uh, now the next one will try this again. Let me just okay. You saw me and I did that. You know what? Let's just delete all of them. 
just want to be messing with Malcolm in the future. The ultimate. Alright. Look up, let's go over to try. Same thing. Make this look simple and clean. And like the Tin Hawk song. Uh, first one with the Tin Hawk. Anyhow. You start with the middle one. Yeah, I start with the middle one. The middle one comes with it. Soon you'll actually understand why I'm not referring to that. Now, if everything's done correctly, now to make a bigger one. This time I can cover the entire area. The entire wide area. I can like Selected. Sorry, never this much there. Now, there we go. It's far better because the small adjustment that I made before. Because if I keep pushing in the little mesh forward, that will happen. That's why I'm right here. Let's try to get all together. Let's be starting to combine and all. And we actually want to get the appearance of carriers. Not the other way around. Because it would just look weird. Okay. So here. We should be done this one. So then, if you already finished with the canvas and you want to create like the tail or you know something different, this is where this video becomes slightly different than the others. Alright? Simple. You see the base here over here? Just click on it. And then, go with the free hand group. Once you do that, all you have to do is just spread it. And that should be all for this video. If you like it, you can you press the like button. And as always, smash that subscribe button. You know, share it to everyone you know, and or anyone that might actually need this type of help. And I will see you on the next video.